Good afternoon, Miss Mary Joy. Good afternoon, ma'am. Okay, Miss Mary Joy, can you tell me about yourself? Ma'am, I am Mary Joy Stringes, 24 years old, a single mother with one child from Calibu Branch. I am a college graduate now. Okay, I have a few questions for you to answer, so let's start. Why do you want to work as a maid? To help, ma'am, to help my family and especially my children in their, my, my child in their education and then to have a size, high salary. Okay, why you choose Malaysia when there is a lot of other country? Ma'am, because Malaysia is near in the Philippines. And the time is same with our time. Okay, how are you qualified for this job? Ma'am, I am qualified for this job because I am a responsible, disciplined, uh, polite and kind and really dedicated to my job. Okay, may I know what is your education level is? I am a college graduate now. What is your recent your uh, what's your recent work experience, or what was your work experience before? I am a logistic clerk before, ma'am. Okay. Have you worked abroad before? No, ma'am. Do you have experience of taking care of baby? Yes, ma'am. I already experienced taking care because I am a mother. Okay. How about elder or older people? Do you have the experience that you take care of before? No, ma'am, but I really willing to learn okay. taking care of the elders. Okay, do you have any other special skills? Ma'am, my special skills are cooking, cleaning, ironing, laundry, and dishwashing. Okay, and yes, go ahead. And a computer literate person, ma'am. Okay. Are you willing to learn new skills? Yes, ma'am. Are you willing to to work with a sorry, are you willing to work with a family with a mother-in-law or any relatives stay together? Yes, ma'am. Uh, currently are you still working now? No, ma'am. Do you know how to cook? Yes, ma'am. So what sort of food can you cook? Uh, Filipino food, ma'am, like Adobo, apertada, tenola, paksiyong ma'am. Okay. Are you aware that you will have to do washing, cleaning, ironing, and cooking? Yes, ma'am. Okay. From all the house chores, like cooking, cleaning, ironing, and washing, which do you like most? Ma'am, cleaning cooking, ironing, and dishwashing. Okay. If ever you were selected to work in Malaysia, who will take care of your kid? My parents, ma'am, especially my mother. Okay. You are not allowed to use handphone or cell phone during working hours. Yes, ma'am. You are only allowed to use handphone or cell phone after you finish all the works and when going to bed. Yes, ma'am. You are strictly needed to surrender the handphone to your employer in the morning and your employer will return back to you once you're going to bed. Yes, ma'am. If ever your employer finds out that you're abusing, abusing your handphone and is affected your work performance, your employer will confiscate your handphone and you're not allowed to hold it anymore. Instead, your employer will allow you to call to your family three times in a month. You're only allowed to bring normal phone and you're not allowed to bring smartphone. Are you agreed for the terms and condition? Yes, ma'am. Are you agreed to the rules and regulation for the handphone? Yes, ma'am. How many years is the contract as you agreed and understand? Two years, ma'am. Can you describe for me your ethics or your attitude? Ma'am, I am a well-disciplined person, responsible, dedicated, and polite. Okay. How can you assure to us that you will work hard in Malaysia? What will you do? Ma'am, I am really dedicated to my job and I will follow the rules and regulation that you, the employer will ask me to follow. Okay. Can you promise not to use a telephone without the permission of your employer? Yes, ma'am. Can you promise not to put on makeup but to dress properly while work? 
Yes, ma'am. Can you promise not to invite friends and relatives without the consent of your employer? Yes, ma'am. Can you promise not to ask for advance salary from your employer under any circumstances? Yes, ma'am. Do you really understand of the rules and regulation of the agency? Yes, ma'am. Do you pay any placement fee for you to come to Malaysia to work as a maid? No, ma'am. Do you suffer from any skin diseases, allergy, or physical defect? No, ma'am. Do you have any history of sickness, example breast cancer or any other illness? No, ma'am. Have you suffered from any serious illness? No, ma'am. Do you smoke? No, ma'am. Do you have any tattoo in the body? No, ma'am. Do you take any prohibited drugs before? No, ma'am. Have you undergone any operation or surgery? No, ma'am. Are you medically fit? Are you fit to work? Yes, ma'am. Are you in any medication? No, ma'am. Are you allergic with any food? No, ma'am. Are you prepared to work for the employer of any race? Yes, ma'am. Are you prepared to eat the type of food taken or given by your employer? Yes, ma'am. Are you afraid of being left alone in the house? No, ma'am. Are you afraid of dogs or other pets? No, ma'am. Can you promise to work according to instruction from your employer? Yes, ma'am. Do you have any immediate family working in Malaysia? No, ma'am. Okay, Miss Mary Joy, we have finished our question section. Let's go to case study. I have a case study for you and I want you to answer me truthfully. Upon arrival in Malaysia within six months, if ever any of your family members pass away, what will you do? Will you continue to work till finish your contract or you will go back? Ma'am, I will continue and finish my contract, ma'am. Okay, tell us about yourself and why do you why do you want to work in Malaysia as domestic helper? I'm married to Miss Dominguez, 24 years old, single mother with one child. I'm a well-disciplined person, respectful, polite and kind, responsible. I I really need Yes, we go ahead. I really need to work in Mar in Malaysia because I, I need to help my family in finances. Okay, Miss Mary Joy, what do you want to tell to your employer who's watching your video? Mom, please choose me because I really need a job to help my I support my family, especially the education of my child. Okay, thank you very much, Miss Mary Joy. We will update your agency if there's any selection made by the employer.